M0FXB. Welcome to my videos on the Zygu X6100. If you find these useful, please like and subscribe to my channel. 73, all the best. M0FXB, let's look at the CW key settings on the Zygu X6100. So, when you're in normal menu, hit key here, and you have two menus. The first menu, we have number one here, and it says key type manual. And we can change this with the multi-function knob. So it's manual, auto right, auto left, back to manual. Then we'll go over to the key speed. And we have 15 words per minute and can be adjusted with the same button. The next one is labelled iambic. And it says iambic A or B. Okay, the next one is tone, and you can change the tone. It's on 800 hertz by default, but you can adjust it with the same button. And then tone level is at 10 at the moment, and again, you can adjust it with the same button. Now let's go to push the key button again. And at the beginning here, we've got QSK time, and if we turn it, we can move that and it looks like it's milliseconds going along. It's DI, DA ratio. And we can change that at the moment. It's at 3.0. And then lastly, we've got CW trainer and that's on or off. So that's about it. The other thing you can do if we back out, hit the general button and then hit radio settings. We do have AGC settings here, AGC knee. AGC slope, AGC hang, and at the top here, we have this button here, which is the AGC button in the middle here. I'll just show you. There, AGC button. This changes the AGC to auto. Let's push it. Oh, we have to back out to change it. AGC off, AGC slow, AGC fast, and back to auto. We also have an AGC meter here, very handy for FT8 as well. This is our audio scope, which can be changed in the radio settings menu. Uh, number, let's try number one, exit that, let's try number two. Let's try display settings. There it is there. So you can control this one with the AF, FFT, AVE, AF, FFT, REF. That's to control this audio scope. Hope this helps. Please like and subscribe if you find this useful. 7-3, all the best.